As the Israel-Hamas war rages on, it is causing a split among Texas Democrats. The top two contenders to take on Ted Cruz in the race for the U.S. Senate are divided on how Israel should fight and how the U.S. should support them. Ryan Chandler spoke to both of them about their stance as they campaign for your vote in the Texas primary. Dallas Congressman Colin Allred stopping short of calling for a ceasefire. This is a war of choice by Hamas. They chose this war. They are still holding over 200 hostages right now. They could release those hostages. They could lay down their arms. You are not calling for a ceasefire no, at not. this time? No, I'm not. I think he's out of touch with reality here. San Antonio State Senator Roland Gutierrez says Allred is out of step with Texas Democrats. He's calling for a ceasefire and says he would put greater conditions on military aid for Israel. Colin Allred needs to take back his position on this issue because we need to stop the killing of women and children. That's not who we are as a nation. <laughs> Since Hamas terrorists killed 1,200 Israeli civilians on October 7th, Israeli counterattacks have killed nearly 20,000 Palestinians, two-thirds of them women and children. That led the Texas Democratic Party to unanimously call for a ceasefire. I understand the complexities of the issue prevent someone from, uh, at this time, uh, Congressman Alder from supporting it. But from our perspective, we think that we have to, as leaders in the Democratic Party, encourage our Democratic leadership to work towards stopping this war. Senator Ted Cruz argues a ceasefire would help Hamas. He's calling for unequivocal support for Israel's defense systems. In the last several days, over 4,000 rockets have rained down on the people of Israel from Hamas. Their objective is to kill women, to kill children, to kill innocent civilians. Both of his top contenders supporting Israel and calling for greater protection for civilians. Israel has every right to defend itself, but they have to do that within the context of the laws of war. I'm not choosing between Israel or Palestine. I'm choosing peace. Ryan Chandler, KXAN News.